Yep.
Come back in here! Come in here! What is this doing? Baltimore riots of 2015, it all started with the death of Freddie Gray. Died from some sort of critical spinal injury. Passed away by a thor passed away two days uh, a couple days ago. Then the funeral happened and the family of Freddie Gray's begs and plead begs people not to riot. But unfortunately, the protesters of the Baltimore riots of 2015 has gone barbaric. If it's not just that, they're looting. They were, they were doing, uh, they were stealing items, and unless I forget, though, they're doing um, arson. And they have injured 16 police officers, and 253 of them got arrested. Look, my thoughts about this. Why the why destroying the black community? I mean, you have black yeah you, know, you have black people rioting against authority, and then there's more reasons to people just lose their insanity. I mean, yeah, I get it. Police police brutality in this day and age is is wrong. I get that racism still exists in America. I get that, but there's not but that's not a way for you. To conduct yourself in society, if you have behaved like an animal, and you like, and they, and being stereotyped for that reason, look, I'm not trying to be racist, and I'm not, which I'm not, but most Black Americans in America love to be stereotyped because they let the stereotypes define them as humans. And they've used their stereotypes and their behavior as a way to justify their livelihood. <clears throat> now, just to just to just to be clear on that, uh, this is not their first riot. This is the second one. The first one took place in 1968 when they when it was rioting due to Dr. Martin Luther King Jr.'s assassination. And that, and that, and back then it was segregation. Back then, there's like 3,500 people get arrested. You know, half of them are dead at the time. But this is going way too far. You have properties being stolen, and now I heard schools in Baltimore were were closing down for for a day or two, and then the Major League Baseball game got canceled because of it. So. Baltimore is going to it's going to take a while for them to clean up and to get back to his feet, but unfortunately, it's in ruins, all because of the protesters reacted very violently. I mean, racism in America still exists, and as a person, we should not try to justify this. We should not be. But I guess people who like to protest and go and way and go way out of line, it's just, it's just, it's just sad to me, because now you have Black Americans now in the Baltimore riots wanting to play the victim and saying like, oh, oh, it's because I'm Black, 
I'm getting arrested. Oh, I'm being murdered or oh, I'm being killed because of my skin color and my race. No, it's your attitude. No, it's their pride. And the people from Baltimore have a lot of pride of not letting go slavery, of not letting go their past in 1968. Because Obama, because now people are condemning it. Because now there is fires, there are houses being burned down. It's pretty much an urban decay. But I don't wish any anything bad for people in Baltimore, especially the family at family for the the, the family of Freddie Gray, but I hope it dies down soon, but anyhow, that's all I'm going to say about this video. Peace out. Later. Bye-bye.